now our next map is heat map and uh, i i will show you heat map and tree map all together because many of interviewers ask this question can you explain what is the difference between heat map and tree map so i will go one by one and i will show the difference okay so first of all i'll create a heat map in order to create heat map you need two uh, dimensions so one i will take uh, let's take segment any dimension you can take segment and then uh, sub category okay one dimension in the co column and one dimension in the row okay now i'll put my, my one measure you can take sales you can take profit everything anything you can take then you can put the in the uh, color sales then in the label okay ah, yeah. not in this way okay let uh, one more thing we need to do is we need to change this to square now we have this a heat map so when the heat is higher when the color is darker you have the highest value you can change the color if you want from here okay and, uh, even you can change you can show some different dimension in the heat if you want like if i want to show the profit in the uh, color then i can change from here okay but uh, uh, I want to say the sales and the and sales for the uh, label and sales for the color. Okay, so this is the heat map. So you will take two dimension, uh, one measure. If you want to if you want to take two measures, you can take one in the color and one in the label. Two dimension you can take. Even you can use only one dimension in the tree map. Okay, so you have only one dimension, and you can use two dimension. Okay, so now let me show you the uh, heat tree map. Okay, let me duplicate it, and you can click here and you can create a tree map. So this is our tree map. Now we are using the same two dimension that we are using in our uh, heat map. And let me remove. Now I have a segment only. So these we have three segment, and let me put this sales to our label. So this is our tree map. Okay, now I'll put the category. Okay, in one more, uh, one more dimension in the detail. Okay, so you can see the this uh, graph has been changed. And uh, what is the difference is here? Let me show you that. If you remember, let me show. Let me show you one more time. Let me, this is our three segment. Okay. So, this is our first segment. This is our second segment. Okay. This is a consumer segment. This is a corporate segment, and this is home office segment. Take it. And uh, you know, we are showing sales here, and we put one more uh, dimension here, category. So this uh, tree map showing a uh, category under the E segment. Okay, and we put the sales. You can see sales in the size, so the bigger box showing the bigger sales. Okay, the, uh, the box size you can see the decreasing. That means the sale the overall sales is decreasing. Okay, the, so the consumer segment is the larger segment. Okay, let me show you if you want to. Okay, uh, segment by sales, okay, segment and sales. Let me cover one more chart for you. Bubble chart. Okay. This is a bubble chart. Bubble, bubble chart. Okay. And I'm putting sales. And and you want to show that uh, consumer segment is the large segment. Okay. This is uh, the bubble chart is also similar to the tree chart, but this is not representing one thing that I will show you. Uh, okay. So you can see. So can the this second word segment is the largest segment. This why that's why the size is the largest one. And uh, okay, so this is representing the only difference between the tree map and the heat map that uh, heat tree map represents the data in the hierarchical way. Okay, so we can see this is the consumer segment, and inside this we have a category segment. If I want to show subcategory inside this segment, 
so you have further divide divide division let me show you that this is one uh, segment and your segment and if you are aware of that that we have this three uh three sub subcategory this one subcategory no uh, sorry uh category one first category second category and third category and inside this category we have subcategories so we have we have three layers segment then under the segment we have category and inside the category we have subcategory okay so if you want to represent your data in this way so i map for you and i just I like i will show you the bubble chart double chart is also same but we can't show the data in, in the hierarchical way in this way that you can show the bubble and uh, like uh, i am showing the color and i am showing the size that's the bigger uh, the bigger bubble has the bigger sales okay this is bubble chart i think now you are clear that tree heat map and tree map both quite similar but we just normal just we just generally show the hierarchical data and the tree map okay if you want to show the hierarchical data if you don't want to we can remove all the category we will take only one dimension and this is not a hierarchical table it's only normal representation this uh, heat map this tree map and this bubble chart both are similar if we are taking only one dimension okay 